It's a cold case that is more than three million years old, and researchers at UT think they've cracked it. Lucy, the most famous human ancestor, appears to have died after falling from a tree. Fox 7's Bridget Spencer joins us in studio with that story. Bridget? Well, guys, the team at UT used special CT scan technology. They got lucky into Lucy back in 2008, but it took eight years to compound all that data that they gathered. They now publish the news in the journal Nature. They also now can give a narrative of one of our oldest ancestors. According to researchers at the University of Texas, it was 3.18 million years ago when a fall of more than 40 feet killed Lucy. She was a member of the Australopithecus afarensis family, very similar to chimpanzees, but a little more human-like. We think she was reaching out, trying to break her fall as she uh, impacted the ground. After several high-resolution x-rays at the UT Jackson School of Geosciences, Professor John Campbellman and his team discovered much more about the life and death of Lucy. It was a combination of skeletal fractures and internal organ damage that killed her instantly. The body rapidly decelerates when it hits the ground. Lucy is one of the most complete adult skeletons from her time. A team from Arizona State University found her in 1974 in the Afar region of Ethiopia. It's an area Kappelman says is flat. The stream that she was found in only deposited thin amounts of sediments. Usually small streams with short thin banks deposit short sediments, short beds of sediment. So we don't think there was any vertical relief on the ground. That only leaves trees. This, among other reasons, leads him to believe trees were aplenty there, and Lucy often slept in them. There are predators around, and going up in the trees at night to nest is one of the reasons chimpanzees do it. This research brings a whole new light to Lucy. What struck me with it was just the feeling of empathy I had for someone who fell, put her arms out, probably as her last conscious act, as an attempt to save herself. At the small size of about three feet six inches tall and just 60 pounds, she still leaves a big impression on the human race, 3.18 million years later. Inanimate bones all of a sudden came to life for me, so understanding her death brought her back to life. Kappelman found similar but less severe breaks on her other shoulder and some in the skull area. Lucy was 15 years old when she died.